everyone and welcome back to my channel my name is Mel this is Mel Spanks and today I have some more DT projects to share with you for my DT package from Shares Minecraft so I hope you guys enjoy today's video so hi everyone and welcome back to my channel hope you guys are all very well today I'm going to be sharing more DT projects that I've made with my design team package from Shares Minecraft if you've never heard of Shares Minecraft I'll leave all her links in the box below she has a YouTube channel and an Instagram channel as well so please do go and check out all those lovely links in the box below she's still in a lot of american brands at the moment she's got a lot of um echo park cartabella stamperia um prima she's got a lot of doodle bugs she's also got lots of photo play as well she's got lots of other american brands in her shop too so please do go and check out her website i'll leave all the links in the box below today i'm going to be using the Fern and Willow collection by Photo Play, designed by Becky Moore, and I'm going to be showing you my two final projects that I've made with the DC package from Shara Sloan Crafts. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you liked today's video, then please do give this video a like, a comment, and if you haven't considered subscribing already, then please do so. And let's get into the video. So the two final projects that I've made are some cards. So I've actually made some TP cards and I've also made some 3D flat fold cards. So I'm going to show you the um, TP cards that I have made. So these are the two that I've made. I've made one in a five inch size and one in a four and, um, four and a half inch size. I made them in these colours. So they're in um, pink. Uh, well, this kind of like my shop is red on the camera, but it's like um, a fuchsia pink, like a magenta pink. And then this one's in the blue colour. I've used the Fern and Willard collection by Photo Play. I love the frogs. They're just so cute. So those are the frogs. The lovely little lily pad. Or the little um, lotus leaf. And it's got the little flowers here as well. And they're just adorable. And I've just used some Velcro and some hook and loop tape here to just attach them together. And this is also a lovely saying from the sticker sheet that I've just decorated on the front. So I'm just going to actually put them together. So they're just made out of... Um, three squares and then you just divide them up in the middle all the squares are the same size so this is the four and a half inch one so i just um velcro them here at the back so they actually stand up into a teepee shape so i hope you guys can see that and this is the bigger one which is the five inch one as well and this will stand up like as well so those are like two these are the two tp cards so you've got the two frogs here on the front of the blue one which i think is gorgeous i love the kind of 3d element of them and the fact that you can actually put them in flat envelopes and your recipient will have to just put them together using the hook and loop tape at the back so that is the lovely one here on the front, which is decorated. Just says life is beautiful in a circle, has the lovely butterflies. I've just used some of the um, stickers. So you've got the flowers, the little, um, the little greetings here and the lovely butterfly too. So that is the first one. Again, I've just used the papers from the lovely collection. I've just put some stickers on the other side of this card as well. And then on the smaller one, I have just put this, the lovely um, frogs on there. So I've just put a fern and willard on the front. There's the flowers here. Loving this life. And it's got a couple of the butterflies as well. And if you wanted to, and you've got the little flower as well on the other, on the other side. If you want to write your message on this one, I would probably say save a space on the back to actually write your message. But you can actually put your message on the inside of the card. All you need to do is just um, cut down some triangles in the same kind of shape um and some of the measurements from say the front of the triangles here maybe the base layer for example and you can actually put the message on the inner side so you can actually get the most the most of the outside so that is the blue one and this is the red one i've actually left a space here for um, this one so the message can go on this side but I love the little TP cards. So those are the gorgeous and um, TP cards that I've made with the design team package. And the final project that I've made are these. So these are 3D flat fold cards. They're called 3D flat fold cards because they stand up on their own like this. So I've just made them in the two different colors. So I've got them in green and then this lovely kind of hot pink color. And then it also folds. So if you actually fold the cards this way, you can actually put them into your envelope so i'll just show you this one here that's in the pink so if you actually um fold it up to the top 
like this you can actually put them flat into an envelope so that's what they look like to the side you might just want to make a little bit of an adjustment with the size of the envelope but this is a five by seven size so this is using the cut parts that i've used um from the fern and willard collection it's got some of these stickers here as well the tutorial that i followed was from a youtuber called paul ford i'll leave that video in the link below it's a really easy card to to put together it's just deciding which colors that you want to use which papers you want to use as well so that is a really fun card and because it's 3d and it sits down and it actually folds up so you can actually put it in the envelope i really really love it so it's just i love the fact that it has that 3d element to it and it actually stands up as well on your table which i really really love so i've just used the flowers from the cut apart i've just used um some of the blue background paper i've used some of the floor um background paper as well from the collection life is beautiful with the little ladybug and the lovely flowers here um you can also put your message on the back so if you have quite a large message then you can actually put it on the back instead so your recipient can read it so that is the pink version that i've made i'm just going to show you the green version so the green version i've made is uh, this one so this has shine bright in the middle has the lovely flowers here and the little ladybug i've just put them up on some foam dots and i've just used some of the paper from the photo play collection so you've got the blue sky here with the lovely sun little dragonflies the little butterflies as well the little clouds and you can just decorate every element of them so at the back at the top here i've just used some of the papers and then i've used the same papers on the bottom as well again you can put your uh, message on the back so that is uh, the lovely card and then uh, again obviously you can just fold this in to an envelope quite flat and then you can actually put it into a lovely envelope that you can also handmade or if you've made um, some pre-bought if you've got some pre-bought um, pre pre-bought pre cards then you can use that envelope as well you just need, you might need to just adjust the size a little bit so those are the two 3d fold cards that i have made if you guys want a tutorial then please do let me know if you like a tutorial on any of the projects that i've shared from the dc package from shower salon cross then please do let me know in the comments box but i hope you guys have enjoyed those projects so i hope you guys have enjoyed those projects that i've made with the dt package from shell simone cross i'll leave all her links in the box below so please do go over to her youtube channel and also her instagram as well and please do have a look at her shop links i'll put all the products that i've used in this video and throughout the other products that i have shared as well this week from the dt package i'll put those links in the box below as well hope you guys have enjoyed this video if you like this video then please do give this video a like comment and if you haven't considered doing so already then please do subscribe to the channel and i'll see you guys in my next video